Mexico and we're gonna go inside and take a look at the new Lounge Fly releases. I'm super excited, so let's go on in. Guess who's back, 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 back again, again, again. I have a problem. You don't need to tell a friend, cause I'm telling you. <laughs> she guys like my uh, impromptu song? That was pretty good. Wanted to show you the window display. I don't know how well it's coming out because it's really bright outside and also really hot. So let's go inside the air conditioning and check it out. I was trying to show them the display, but I got hot <laughs> for the two seconds I was outside. I know, the teacup one is real sweet. Okay, this and is, I have the teacup dapper day dress, so. This is $50. Um, Which again, I think is a not, com compared to the Junie and Burke lines. It's nice and purple. Now I will say, come over here, compared to this, this is definitely more of a pure white. This is the new hats one, and this is this more like a, like a beige or a something, beige but it looks pink to me. So to me, this is definitely more of a pure white. Um, definitely room for your phone, and you, there's little car pocket holders, and I moved out of the spot, and it got crowded there, so let's get back in here. No worries, I'll stand right here. Here's the backpack. So sweet. So cute. And they're all the same, I mean, really, they are all the same design, where they're 75. Um, miniature and then they have the front zip pocket as well as the one large pocket. So it's all the um, dark purple on the inside. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, we can see on the lip a little bit. Um, but then the two pockets and then it has the little side pocket for like your phone or whatever. Another side pocket. I did try to put a water bottle on mine and it's too big so it does not hold a water bottle. If you're curious, mommy can do the Dole Whip one next since that's up here and kind of right in our way still. Okay, to me this isn't as cute. It does, well I actually, if I had no Disney frame of reference, I wouldn't, I, would I wouldn't realize, realize that's that that's a, a yeah, a Disney, do you know what I'm saying? Like I feel like the Dapper Day Dole Whip dress is a lot easier to recognize as a Dole Whip than right. the bag is. Yes, exactly. Okay, but I didn't really get the orange bird craze until this kind of stuff started coming out. I mean, that I have the so orange bird tiny. dress, so I feel like I need this that. Is the size of, like, compared to my hand. Look at this little beak. Oh my gosh, is that cute? And I like that it, they are offering, because they kind of do offer the same stuff. I right. like that that is a different style this is a and different size. size. This is um, the size I think that we would carry. Because then it gets hard to That's justify buying the same different patterns because they are That's all the money. same bag. You know yeah. what I mean? Look at the lining, can you see oh, that? Oh, cute, yeah. So cute. I love the little, or the the leaves in the way for when you're trying to zip, is that annoying? No, it's more that little plastic um, styrofoam. Oh, and that won't be in there when you have it. But that is so cute, and then... Oh. You gotta go back for that one, yeah, there you go. Here's the backpack. Oh. I mean, really though. Back straps. I bet you that has the orange bird interior as well. I almost feel that this is a little softer than the other ones because of the print maybe. It does look like it's more rounded also at the top. I don't know if that's my imagination. It is the orange bird. Oh, you can see in the inside. Gosh, so cute. cute. And he's got the, he's the little leaves. Just so cute. <laughs> it does look a little rounder. Yeah. And then no, it is softer. That This definitely has more structure, and it looks like it's more structured, where that looks more round, which makes sense because he's a bird. So maybe they did structure that a little bit differently. Okay. And then Cheshire. This one has gunk on it. But this is then the longer one. This is the back. Which is sweet. I like the stripes. It's I like, like his the tail. Stripes. And the, all the wallets are $50. And the backpacks are $75. Yeah. So we showed the first one, but are not showing you on all of them for that reason, because they're all the same price. Um, so then the, it's got the double side, like the longer ones, all the double side card holders, and then the zip for your money or whatever. You can put your phone in there. Okay. Back, yeah, they have a back and a front. So look at those little bangs, they're cute. Those eyebrows are so dark. Oh, and they're cat ears. That is so cute. And then this one has a stripe. Yeah. And it's interesting where they decide to put the logo. I mean, obviously, for the teacups, the lounge fly logo is right center, but they can't do that on him because that's where his face is. So, so his here. is in the corner. Um, and then this has the stripe lining. Stripe lining. Super, cute. Super, super cute. So that's all of that new stuff, but I really like that. That orange bird one. Mom, we still have Haunted Mansion and the... Oh, I, so for some reason, I'm sorry, I thought you showed that already. Um, no. 
fanny packs are definitely the deal. This is like we the are new... seeing fanny packs everywhere. Yeah, I probably just passed like four or five guys wearing fanny packs on the guys, not girls. Guys, yeah. yeah. It's so not these, of course, but fanny packs right. are the deal. So the fanny packs are 40, and it's got the Haunted Mansion The brand. wallpaper inside, that's cool. Um, one big zip there, here's another like top zip. I guess that goes more towards the back. So I maybe yeah. put my phone there, because then you could feel it buzzing. Yeah. And, and then, then this nice the big waist. buckle for around buckle. your waist. And then here is the backpack. So again, same one zip across the front, the one big zip top. Let's check the lining. Um, and I will say... We're like messing with the paper there. There we go. I will say it's pretty crowded in here, and I've already seen people walking off with, with, handfuls, with handfuls. Yeah. Handfuls of this one specifically. And as far as I understand, these only came out this weekend, so these have not been out for very long. Here's the wallet and the bag. Okay, I really like this one. So this is one I was explaining to mom. Guys, correct me if I'm wrong. I know it was not a lounge fly, but they had this exact um, like design of a regular full-size backpack in the parks before. And now lounge fly has released it with their collections, this 45. 45, okay. I wonder if it's because the ears and the bow. Well, and then the sequin, so. Yeah. So for you, you did get the sequin for on the rose, the rose gold, gold one, yeah. And it ended up messing up with your clothes, right? Yeah. So yeah, yeah. I wore it, but granted, I wore it all day. I actually took it to Washington with me, and it rubbed the back of my cotton shirt, and it healed my shirt. Yes. But, so, so the cool thing about this is it's all of the sequins, but in the back, it's not. So they probably no realized they probably that. Probably heard that um, from the rose gold one. I still have it though. I love it. It's and beautiful. Then, Here's the backpack. So sequins are not on the back the of that sequence. one. So that's really smart. You're getting the sequins everywhere else. Um, so let's check the price of this one. Just that one's the sequins. This one's 85. 85. So, so it's 10 it more dollars. But I think that that's how much the rose gold one was. And then here's the wallet. It's the bigger one again. And this one's 50. Yeah. So see, I feel sequins like... Sequins on both sides. I feel like that smaller size wallet, the orange bird size, is better for these smaller backpacks. Because it's a big wallet. If you're wanting to buy the set like I do, I like for the things to match. That takes up a large portion of the space in your backpack with that big wallet. It's really cute. So the wallet I know, I feel is like both sides sequin. I have my rose gold one, but I feel like I need that one too. I don't know though. That orange bird though. So cute. Another thing Ever After has is the Enchanted Disney Fine Jewelry Collection, and it looks like these are some of their newer pieces. They have it all displayed as a Snow White case. So they've got the Evil Queen's dagger and heart. And you guys can see that on the necklace. These this are ring. definitely pricier pieces. These are 500. The earrings? But those are cufflinks. Oh, oh. Hm. So, this, so then this is a man like man jewelry because Abel and I saw this last night and we were wondering this ring that looks masculine is so I mean yeah it's fine jewelry this is definitely like the real stuff those earrings bow earrings are 700 here is the um, I guess maybe Cinderella display or just general Mickey this is general Disney because there's a castle and, but I really like um, this one look at Aladdin's lamp that's really pretty Love the star ring and the star earrings. That one's and Tinker Bell on the back, if you can see that. And then there's Tink like flying, I'd say, with with the key with the castle, maybe. And now this is pretty neat. I haven't seen this before. This goes with the rose gold over here. Yeah, this is a whole rose gold display. Look at the minion Mickey, so pretty. And the castle or the crown ring with the Mickeys on it. And that ring's neat. And I love that. Like a double ring. They've got the price tags hidden so I can't see any yeah. of those. I hope that you guys can see that. I know that's kind of far away. Beautiful watches. I love that crown. That one looks like Aurora's crown to me. Okay, that one has a price tag on it.
and then the Mickey, the Mickey studs. This one is 750. Well, of course that's the one I like. <laughs> yeah, rich tastes girly. Here's more of the Enchanted collection. We've got a Snow White apple. This whole display does have the prices on it. You guys can see the little black tiles. I love how they have this display though. So this is, as I said, definitely a Snow White. We've got Dopey right here. And then these are just some rings. Again, the prices are listed there. Yeah. All right. This is a Cinderella one. I love the shoe. And then this one, I was just ooing and aahing at the Beauty and the Beast. Yeah. Look at this ring right here. I want that ring for Christmas. <laughs> And I'm finding out actually that I'm allergic to a lot of costume jewelry. Um, so I'm kind of having to purchase the real gold jewelry. I guess that's just an excuse, right? But coming back is stunning. You can see me in the background in the mirror. <laughs> And this one's beautiful too, the Enchanted Rose. And then there's some over here as well. Mom said um, these ones are just more like castle icons. So you've got those earrings and the necklace. These rings are $100 each. Those are cool. It's kind of what I was looking at up here, the carriage ones. And those are fun. So those might be seasons then because she's staying in that other place. Those more expensive ones are all real gold. Oh, real, real gold? Real, um, like diamonds and stuff. Oh, gotcha, okay. So this might be real gold, but then Swarovski crystal or... The Tinkerbell one's pretty. I did. I'm gonna scoop up there in a second. This Mickey's really pretty too. On the black chain. I love these um, Mickey head boots. Oh, those are beautiful. I like the filigree of this one. Then there's a cuff up there that I'll show you too that kind of has the same thing. Another castle. And some more colorful rings. Those are all 100. Look at this um, bangle with the filigree. Isn't that cool? Really pretty. And there's so much more. There's three huge cases. So there's a lot of jewelry to pick from for sure. Alright, those are the new lounge fly pieces plus some of the Disney Enchanted Jewelry Collection. I hope you enjoyed looking at it with me. Please give this video a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you aren't already and I'll talk to you later. Bye!